Dozens of not-for-profit organizations want a piece of a $3 million pie. The money comes from Naperville's 1% citywide food and beverage tax, otherwise known as the city's SICA fund. But as NCTV 17's Jenny Barger found out, there is not enough pie to go around. DuPage Symphony Orchestra board members hope the new concert season won't start on a sour note. The orchestra is composed of volunteer musicians who together provide music to all of Naperville. This year they applied for three separate SICA grants totaling almost $42,000. One of them is for the Naperville Fine Arts Fair where we have musicians go down there. We also have a summer concert at Central Park in Naperville, the biggest of the three is for our annual uh, subscription series of concerts. The DuPage Symphony Orchestra is just one of the 99 organizations fighting for a grant. This year's pot is just over $2.9 million. The SICA committee received requests equaling $3.8 million. Over the next two months, a board of commissioners will review the applications and present recommendations to city council to decide which organizations received funding and the amounts. We all um, do our homework in advance, make our individual recommendations for what we think the funding should be for that group, and then we go by as a group and um, review the whole process. The pot could get smaller. With the city facing an $11 million deficit, council members say as much as a quarter of this year's SICA fund could be cut meaning a loss of about $600,000. If council then decides that some of the money has to go to improving the infrastructure because the funds aren't anywhere else, that's up to them. Likewise, if council should decide to lower the tax. Naperville is a vibrant place and we will always have arts and culture um, no matter you know, how much it has changed or not. As for the organizations, they would have to figure out a way to pay for their activities without the city's help. And for some, that could mean raising prices or even canceling events. We will have to reallocate our budget, which could mean less of the community outreach of the free programs that we're offering. The SICA Commission will review the applications and present their recommendations at a public meeting on January 30th and 31st. I'm Jenny Barger for Naperville News 17. This year, Naperville Community Television applied for $36,000 to fund this show, Naperville News 17. The SICA funds are awarded in the spring of 2010.